Today I'm going to show you how to tone a canvas. Um, there's a lot of different ideas on color on toning canvases. A lot of plein air painters like to use uh, an off red color to accent the greens. It's very controversial and it's, you know, whatever you feel like doing, but you really do need to work on a toned canvas, even if it's just a gray canvas. This white is just too bright and you don't get the right color tones. Plus, if you miss a little stroke when you're painting, you're going to, little hair there, you're going to have a lot of white canvas showing through. So I highly recommend that you work on a toned canvas. And it can be a, a similar tone to what the painting is going to be, or it, it can be a compliment. Today I'm going to tone this canvas in shades of yellow because what I'm going to do is I'm going to paint an underwater scene later. And of course the top part is going to be where the light comes through the water and it's going to be a green and then we're going to get into darker blues and then browns down here. And I think the yellow, if any of it shows through, will complement the, the colors that are already there. Now, when you tone a canvas, you um, you should probably use a big brush and um, when you're when you're when you're toning it you want to um, put on a lot of paint and then use turpentine to, to, to loot it down get it all covered And your brush strokes can go any way you want. They're not going to show through. You're going to just do a very light coating here. You saw me put those big globs of paint on, but I'm going to just mush them down into the canvas there. Now you can use other mediums like liquid or something else. I just use turp because I've got some here to rinse my brushes out later. Got a little brush hair right there. Got to get some tweezers and get out that's gotten stuck in the gesso. I always triple gesso my canvases. So, now you see I've got this on here. And I'm going to just take a plain old paper towel and wipe it off. Wipe the excess off. Because it's thin, so thin with the turpentine, it's not going to take too long to dry. Some people go ahead and paint right on the tone canvas while it's still damp, but that's going to pull the color out of it. I prefer to wait and do it later. A lot of times in the evening when I'm done painting, I'll take and um, whatever colors I've got left on my palette, mix them together, make a nice gray, and um, use it to tone some canvases for the next day or the next week. I hope you've enjoyed this little tip and um, tone your canvases. This is Delilah with Art by Delilah, and I have a passion for painting. Thank you.